Hey guys, my name is Andrew from ecomexperts.io and we're back with another Shopify app review. So um, this week we're going to do an entire series about Metafield apps and we are going to dive right in and we're going to show you the Metafield Manager app. So let's go and check that one out. So let's say that you need more than just the title description and the product description, and you need a, a separate field on your product page, but there is no space in the back end to add this field. What would you do? Or you want to add a, a picture or a video or yeah, just a text box or a URL or anything. You want to add additional information. So you reach out to an agency and they will help you fix it true but even the agency will tell you to use a meta field apps meta fields basically allow you to add fields in uh, different pages or product pages whether that is general pages collection pages or even home pages and in that field you can store additional information from pictures to video to text boxes and so this week we're going to cover the meta field manager app which allows you to do exactly this, add more information to a specific page, more, more fields to a specific page. The installation of Metafield Manager is as simple as downloading the app from the Shopify App Store, uh, integrating it with your Shopify or Shopify Plus account, and the app will automatically take you into this main dashboard. Uh, as you see, the dashboard, the dashboard, I'm sorry, looks clean. It's easy to navigate. It's not a masterpiece of design, but we're here for functionality, not necessarily design. So from here, you can choose from editing your meta fields configuration, adding meta fields, editing your custom object configuration, creating, modifying custom objects, import from CSV files, export from CS to CSV files, import from export file, generate export file, or bulk upload assets. That sounds intimidating, but let's break it down. Let's start with adding some meta fields to the test page we've created for this purpose. When you click edit meta field configuration, new window will open with your global meta field configuration for each object title. This is easy, even for beginners. Let's add a meta field to the page object. Click on the blue button that says add a meta field. It's important to mention that this step is the same on every object. You have a meta field handle and a type of meta field you want to add. You can choose from HTML, image, file, multiple files, custom objects, strings, integers, which are numbers, lists, checkbox lists, select, date, and a Boolean, which is true or false. We will start with, let's say, HTML. So we will add custom HTML. We will go with the text for page as a meta field handle. For those who don't know what meta field handle is, it's like a key to use and know what you are calling the right meta field. Now, we need to save this in configuration like this. And we need to actually add the data by clicking on add meta field. We will select page as it's the object type, then click on object you want to edit. In our case, it's a meta field app. That is the page we created for this video. So let's click on that. As you can see, the new HTML attribute is on our shop page. We'll go and we write something like, I hope you're having a great day and save the changes. After all this is done, scroll down and the liquid code snippet will appear right here. It would be great if the text would appear automatically on the page. This way you need to go and enter the code manually to your page. It's not too difficult, even if you haven't done it before. We'll show you that step too. But all right, good to keep in mind. So go ahead and click on online store, then teams. Click here, actions and edit codes. Once you found the page or the product you want to edit, just paste the code where you want it to appear. Now let's see how it looks like on our page. Here it is. Our message is on the page looking awesome. <laughs> but why stop here? Let's add a checkbox and maybe a video. So go back to the app and go to edit your meta field configuration. Then scroll down to the page object. Here, click on add meta fields. Enter video for a handle and choose file. We will add one or more meta field for checkbox. Handle shipping and choose checkbox. Save configuration and go back to the home page. 
From here, click on the Add Meta Fields, same page as before, and two new windows appeared. For the video, we will go with something like this. Shipping part is a little bit different, and we need to configure it. So go ahead and click on Configure. New window appears asking for additional information for this meta field entry. Let's write shipping information, label free shipping, value yes. Add new label standard shipping, value no. Save it and insert the code to the page code. Minifield Manager makes it easy to set up custom functionality for your business. Once the functionality has been built, it's easy to use the dashboard and it makes it relatively easy to maintain. No more having to go back and forth with developers to enter the content or to hard code anything. What makes this app great is that you can easily add videos, product, blog posts, or collections, extra images, HTML, content, you name it. And you can add related products and even articles. So many features are possible here. And you can import and export meta fields in bulk using the CSV uploader, which is really useful when you have to add a particular field of information to a thousand separate projects. Customer service is offering a service 24-7, which is very impressive. If you are stuck with any of the app's feature, which is, yeah, a great thing. The app comes with a 14-day free trial and a free plan is available. All in a pretty great app. Our only complaint is that you need to add the code manually. But as you'll see, when we compare others, this is pretty standard. And we did it in two minutes, so it's not a huge problem. Okay, guys, that is it for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment if you have any questions or concerns. Uh, and if you need any Shopify work done, you make sure to always check us out on ecomexperts.io. Thanks a lot, and see you next week for another Metafield app review.